Hi everyone, welcome back to the Monster Hunter Generations Showcase. I'm Jay Crazy614 and today's monster is Shogun Sienatar. He's available as a quest in 4 star and a quest that would be a key quest is a capture quest which is the one I'm doing. So let's see if I can find him. <coughs> Sorry about that. As I said before, he's available as a four-star quest in the village, but also a two-star quest in the hub at the earliest. Here, um, I'm not exactly sure where where he stars, but gotta start around here somewhere. There's the little little Cenotars. Whereas I'm bringing a Mufa sword, which is level 2, so... Alright, he's not saying I should've went to, uh, the other way. Ugh. Don't remember if he starts in 4 or 5 now. If I choose wrong... I might... In, nah. There he is. He starts in five. And this guy returns from Freedom Unite. Let's see. Right now, they just gave him a normal show. No wyvern, no special wyvern scalps like. Like his cousin Daimyo Hermitor. However, there is a big change from Free Unite to Generation. And that is, he can now cause bleeding. Particularly when his claws are out. And much like his dime cousin, he loves to ram at you from below. Unlike his cousin, he does it with his face. Because his face has a blade on it. That's what to watch out for. Those blades were out. Ooh, I got our first mount. And didn't land in the best of positions, so. Alright, now we got our sleep, so let's see if this sleep bombing tactic works. Oh! <laughs> Stupid cats! Waking up our uh, Shogun Sienatar. They were so busy attacking the Isle Prey that they woke up Shogun Sienatar by mistake. Now... Because I'm doing a catch request, I do have a little bit of a custom set I made specifically for capturing monsters. Where I'm using a gargoyle ass and I'll, the isle prey waste. 
in. I gemmed him a bit of the perception jewel so I can get that capture guru going. Now originally this set is meant to work with weapons that have a high charge. Well that can charge attack like the great sword. Claw Sun's out, claws out. And here's our second mount. Sorry, Mr. Krabs, if that's what you are. But time for Sword Dance level two. Focusing on those claws. Oh, that was bad. But at least he's leaving. Alright, it's not flashing yet. So I still got work to do. Maybe I should have gotten some less aggressive cats. It looks like old Shogun's tired. Even his claws aren't out. Ah, oh, you're so tired. You really need a nap. Luckily, I got a way to provide you one. Now, if you would just cooperate. But he won't. Yeah, so glad to jump a ten. But now he's so angry he won't go to he won't wear out. And now he has. Alright. Now for a little interesting tactic on my part. Yeah, you can set up on us with your aerial jump. <laughs> and I'm so glad I have Ooh, he's now in He's now in... Oh. <sighs> Alright, now... Alright, managed to trick him onto the trap, and there goes Shogun Sienna Tar. Pretty fun fight. And I didn't get to show that he can cause bleeding. But that's all for this episode. I'm JCrazy614. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. And adios.